All right, it's a gorgeous day out, and so what happens? We change our plans completely. What? What, Connor? <laughs> Makes sense to me. <laughs> it does make sense. It's just too nice out. What's today? December what? 28th or something? 28th. So we're going to fire this thing up. Connor wants to clean it up and wash it and all that kind of stuff. We're going to see if we can get it running anyway. Yep. Uh, what is it? It's just above freezing. It's probably 38 degrees. Yeah. Why do I feel so nice and warm? This is like a summer day to me now. Because you're used to the cold. It's amazing what not wearing a coat will do. Let me make sure everything's neutral. <laughs> yeah, I'd run my camera over. I'd be upset. I'd run me over. Wow, you're replaceable. This <laughs> camera costs 200 bucks. I already got my replacements. <laughs> Two of them. Yeah, I know. Oh, you already did try. Did we throw the? Did we turn the fuel off or something stupid? I don't think so. Like we keep doing all the time. I gave it a little whip. You gotta be uh, ready to give it another little whip, I guess. I don't think we turned the fuel off. We we swore that method off when we cranked it half a day last time. Okay. I'm not giving it too much of a whip, but yeah, a little no. bit. Yep. Up. Not all the way, 
because we still got to pull them apart and stuff. My golly, the thing's moving. I can't believe it. the drive shaft? No. So where's the pressure going? We gotta figure this out before we burn it up. got to find out which screens are running those clutches. So it doesn't stop the drive shaft now, so it's not the torque converter. Nope. That All right. problem is solved. <laughs> On to the next problem. Yep. That's awesome. I guess we got to go look in the book, huh? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's go look in the book and find out what's going on. Oh, that screen's terrible. Well, let's go clean it up. We're going to have to clean that like six times. Of... Well, see, it's pulling enough until that junk comes out. Okay, I think we get it. You might have been right. I'm never right. <laughs> <laughs> all right let's try it who knows this is a reusable screen though so let's clean it up let's go break clean it it's going to pull up more crap we're going to be do? we're going to do it and we're going to do it again and we're probably going to do it like 19 freaking times what? you heard me 19 times well maybe 18 that's my final offer okay so far we've we've gotten that screen and now we're into this big filter back here, which is that filter right there. Oh. That's when, when you pull the filter cartridge up out. It all dumps it right there. It dumps it there, yeah. so it's still on the outside of the filter still when you start it up. The Little gem. Rubberized. <laughs> That's a fly. That's a fly. How'd a fly get in there? Oh, well. I don't think he's going to make it. All right, so we got to get filters. That's the Wix number. I got that screen cleaned, and the, that's back on. So we put that filter in, fire up, and then... Then take the screen apart again, right? Yeah, I think we're gonna do it multiple times. Yep. That plugs on there. I think we're gonna ignore it for right now. Spring. Got to. Don't forget the spring. I would not forget what the that spring. look like. This thing? Not bad, really. No, it's really not. It's pretty Give good. it a quick wipe. But it looks like probably wiping it just gave it more lint. Not lint. Yeah. Got a filter. Oh yeah, it's filter. This is the filter part. Okay, so we're gonna tighten that down. Get that going, we'll fire this thing up and see what happens. It's so safe. Look at how safe all this stuff is. I gotta cross this, and then cross that. Okay, here we go. Whoops. Woo! What's not working? I mean, besides everything. What's it doing? Shaft, shaft spinning? Yeah. Kill it, yank the screen out again. Let's see what happened to the screen, if anything. Maybe there's no oil even got up to it yet. Oh, but why not? You know what's funny? Because it's got well, it's got to suck from the sump. It goes up to the screen and it goes down to the pump. So it may take a little bit for that pump to pull up the oil. You think so? I don't know. I don't know if you want to. Pull well, the screen. Let's pull the screen. We go and start it. 
Wow, it's squeaking. That makes it sound like it didn't get no oil. I'll bet there's no oil up there. You think there's no oil up there? Or that piece of rubber hose is slipping shut. Or the pump's totally shot. No, pulled oil. Fire it up. All right. What do I do with the daggum screwdrivers this time? There they are. Dag gummy. I got my key. What are we doing today? Oh boy. Well, we got some more fluid for the uh, Case 1150 because it stopped moving again, even though we uh, pulled the screen out, cleaned it out. Connor says it's low, uh, and it is low, but it, it's on the stick though. Usually things move when they're on the stick. I don't know, man, that uh, tube's down there pretty low. I don't know if it was a suck itself dry, but, because you gotta figure, Con, when it's full, they're also compensating for being at a severe angle, going up and down hills. Oh, they're compensating. <laughs> Who isn't? <laughs> So Connor's got mixed emotions this morning, don't you, Connor? Well, I hope it works and runs because we'll have a dozer, but then I wouldn't care if it didn't because then I can use the engine. So. <laughs> yeah. This is a win-win. Yeah, it, right. So if it doesn't run, we're not going to cry in our no, cornflakes. No, we're not running to the bar if it doesn't run. I haven't ran to the bar in quite a while. I know, but, well, you never know. <laughs> yeah, hey, we'll stay away the from the bar. Yeah, hey, it's uh, Misty out here. Notice I'm going to let him do all the work. Hey, everything's snowy and wet, slippery. Yeah, it's not as pretty today as it was yesterday. Right here. Oh, I suppose I got openies for you. Oh, this, these buckets are great for tearing your fingernails off. Holy smokes, huh? Want me to do it? No, I can do it. I already got that one. Oh, you do, don't you? Yeah. Did you already pull the plug? No. Well, then I'm pulling this one. Pull the plug and run. Oh man, it's like winter out here today. Yeah, the weather changes every day. <laughs> Yesterday was like summer. Jeez. Well, summer and 38 degrees. Is five gallons of oil lighter than five gallons of water? Cause yes, it is. It feels it. It is. What do you think? Oh, well, that's why it always floats on water. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Glad we got to the bottom of that. Now then you tell me, just tip it all the way upside down. Just flip it over. I don't know if you know this, but I didn't say a word. Yeah, you are gonna. Those are just the voices in your head. I beat you by three seconds on that one. <laughs> just tip it over. Hey, well, you're spilling. No, I'm not. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Actually, I don't know. I just pushed the camera up there. So anyway, I guess if it doesn't move, there's going to be certain dozer parts for sale. <laughs> <laughs> not yeah. the motor, though. We'll We're keep that. Really. What do you want to do with that motor, anyway? I'd like to throw it in a tractor. What tractor do you want to throw this in? Uh, I would like to get another uh, Comfort King case matic and put a six cylinder in it because I didn't make that. How about a 1030 with a blow motor? Well, I'd be game for that too. 1030s are awesome, man. We had one. Pretty much anything that's cheap and needs a six cylinder case engine. That's kind of what I'm looking for. Okay. That's fair enough. Why don't you stick the stick in it and see how much oil's in it? And then we'll fire it up. Well, I think I think you do have to read it when it's running. Well, what's it say? Well, we're waiting. <laughs> Copyright infringement. Now Caddyshack's gonna oh, be no, after us. That guy's dead. It's up to the line now. Let's start it up. All right. Yeah. Then you're gonna check it again or see if it just moves. Yeah, we're gonna do both of those things. It took four gallons to get it all the way up there? Yep. You might be onto something. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's pretty low. <laughs> yeah, I think we've just been cavitating our pump. Oh, good. In foamy liquids. Well, it's it's good for uh, resealing them when you <laughs> let them run dry. <laughs> they got to get oxygenated. Again, yeah, they get they? oxygenated, reseals them. <laughs> it's awesome. Here, one cylinder trying to hit right away. Yeah. The rest of them are not cooperating. Ready? Yep.
back and forth till it quits, and if it quits, we check the screen again. Maybe we had to check the screen anyway. Like and subscribe. Hope you enjoyed the video and we'll see you next time.